Hi, everybody. My name is Alejandra Lopez. I'm a writer and director. And my first encounter with Nali was through Voces Nueva, which is a short film contest uh, they did with Cine Sony, my short The Blue Cape won uh, the grand prize. And most recently, I directed Marvel's first Spanish language podcast called Wolverine La Larga Noche, which you should probably check out if you haven't. <laughs> Well, I remember after after winning the the Voces Nuevas contest, I my name appeared on a Deadline article. So that <laughs> that was you know that was pretty big for me, and and people started emailing me, you know, like they wanted to rep me and stuff or see more of my work. So it's it's you know win, winning that contest for sure placed me like yeah made made made, made Hollywood knew that I was. I was I was there to work. Hola, my name is Sara Seligman and I'm a filmmaker. I was part of the Latino media market with Coyote Lake and Plan B, and I was part of the Latino Media Fest with Hardwired. Through the Latino media market, I met my mentor who helped me write my first feature. He guided me through the process of writing, through the process of finding a producer and submitting it then to other festivals and just basically getting it made and, and getting my first opportunity as a director. Hi, I'm Michelle Salcedo. I'm a writer director. Um, I participated in the Nalit Media Market both in 2020 and 2021. My short film Piel Canela Cinnamon Skin played uh, as part of the Nalit Showcase for the 20th anniversary at the AMPA screening, which was fantastic. I first found out about Nalit in 2008. I went to the Media Summit and I met a ton of Latino filmmakers in the industry and it was fantastic because I went to so many panels and it was really empowering to see like-minded individuals. And I actually met an executive producer, Esther Reyes, who then led to uh, an editing job. And I um, was working on a show called Dale Con Ganas, which was one of the first reality shows in um, Univision. And it was a fantastic experience because I met so many other Latina editors and Latina producers and Latina directors, and it really has helped my career all along. Hi, my name is Lisa Barrera, and I'm a writer, director, producer from Dallas, Fort Worth, Texas. I am an alumni participant from the Latino Media Fest of 2016. The programs in Alip offer, I think they're super crucial in terms of not only educating Latinxes and Latinos, but like, I really do feel that it's integral in terms of like giving us the next step into our careers. Uh, the pitches and being in rooms where you have to practice how to, you know, sell your sell your project is super important. And I think that's something that a lot of times that a film school can't offer. And so I think that's why the programs in Alip are is super important for filmmakers like myself. Hey, what's up? My name is Dominic Colon. I am a writer currently staffed on the Netflix show Pink Marine. Uh, and I also have projects at Hulu and at 20th and Anthony Hemingway Productions. I am very proud to be an alumnus of Nali. I did the Latino media market in 2017 and 18. And I am a inaugural finalist of the Latinx list in 2020. So the first uh, event that I had the opportunity to take place in was the Latino Media Market and the Latino Media Summit. And to come from New York and to meet so many different creators and create community um, in Los Angeles. Um, it was weird because I actually had to go to Los Angeles to uh, create some of the community that was already here in New York that I didn't know about. And that is one of the beautiful things that Nalib does. Um, it builds bridges, it creates community, it creates familia, and um, I was hooked. This season of giving, show your support for, for Latino, Latinx, Latine content by donating to Nali to continue providing resources for underrepresented filmmakers.